Alright, one to two weeks prior, the ground should all be checked to make sure that there's nothing in the area. There shouldn't be wood with nails in it. Make sure that the grounds are clear. We're going to do a little check here right now. Okay, we also need to make sure that the speakers work in the overflow room and outside. In order to do that, I already did this. Hit this button, that's the power. You're going to hit this power on the mixer board. Make sure that this is on. Get the computer on. Over here. Power button down here. Mouse and stuff there. Make sure that these speakers are on. So you can confirm over here. And then we're going to go to the overflow room. Also to note, this amplifier is to go to the speakers that go outside through these walls. So we're going to hit that switch here. I need to label this, but I believe CD is what it needs to be on for those to work outside. Also there's one other amplifier in the back corner over there. Make sure that the power is turned on over there and make sure that the speakers work. There's also speakers outside along those walls that should also be able to work. This is the amplifier here for outside. The power should be a CD. See if we got it outside. Go into the hunt, the chapel, the Huntington Chapel, and we have a whole bunch of promo videos here. One in particular is a full one, which is like two hours long. There we go, chapel promo full. Click on that one, and people can listen to that as they come in. To put it on over here. Go to the TV, hit the power button, and once you do that, it kind of takes a while. This blue light here indicates that it's powered on. It takes a while to warm up. I'm gonna come back to it. We're gonna go to the amplifier, which is here. This is labeled. Power is already on. Then you hit booth for sound booth of the chapel. All right, now we got the music coming out of the speakers. All right, this is already set up over here. If you're not getting the screen, just go into channel up or down and HDMI one is what it is currently. Oh no, that's what it is not supposed to be. Uh, PC, yes, PC is what it is supposed to be. There we go. So they have video. And we have audio in this room. All right, so also we need to create packets of upcoming information. So we get 80 to 100 
uh, families normally we get a large envelope with information that we stuff inside of it, two things that we put on the front which is instructions and a preview of upcoming events. Um, we already checked for outside speakers working, we'll make sure that those are set. Promo videos playlist, I showed the full promo vi video list but we'll also make sure to have like rule sets so make sure that everything is lined up so it's ready to go. Um, that everything there at least is ready for that day. All registration stuff set, flyers posted in Chamberlain Hall, handout packets, so all the promotional stuff set ready to go. Okay, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to walk in as if nothing has been touched and it doesn't necessarily have to happen in this order, but we're going to turn everything on. So here we go, walk into the sound booth. Step on this to turn the lights on. Bam. Power. Got that. Power on this. That's good. Turn the power on the computer. There, I turn that on. So everything's powering up. Then we're going to go over to these speakers. And as I mentioned, the amplifier is here. I actually labeled it now. So, and I wrote it here spe speakers one only or if there's two two if more so make sure that the one is down if there's no speakers going if you don't hear them outside it's because you should just have one uh, surround off is best so when you hit this you'll notice different things happening here so that if there's any of these lights on that's surround on so you don't want that light on you want surround off that's the best for outside make sure you hit this it says booth so it's already on CD, so that should be ready to go. Computer's logging on. We're going to go over to the speakers. And to the other amplifier. To turn these speakers on, there's a power button on the back, but instead of doing that, they did it where all you need to do is hit the power on the switch. Makes it easier. So just turn this on, and this should be ready to go. To confirm it, you see a blue light blinking. So those are on. We're going to go over to this one, same thing, there's two speakers, but they leave the power on, on these speakers, so all we need to do is hit the power on the switch, alright, down here, okay, you see that light on, and that light turns on, alright, so the speakers are on, we're going to go over to this amp, I labeled these as well, Hit the power button. Okay, you see something on there. So speaker A. So make sure. So there's this button for speaker A, speaker B. You can have both of them. But speaker A only is the setting that we have it on. And make sure you hit this one, which is booth, which is on the CD function. So we hit that. That should be ready to go. Volume is there if you need it. <coughs> We're going to pull up a video, and we're going to go outside also to check that the speakers are going. So let's go into this one. We're just going to do a test, so we'll put this one on. If for whatever reason there's nothing happening through here, this is the settings on the mixer. There's input 1 through 8, 9 through 16, or this one. So, this is the one you want to hit. This third row, look here, this is PC. If it's muted, you won't hear anything. Okay. Now we're going to check it. So 
these speakers are going. Let's check it outside. So this speaker is going and there's one more around the corner up front, which is on that amplifier. Also, we'll check this one. We turn the amplifier. This is the speaker for the amplifier inside in the corner. So that's working. Nothing going on in here because I didn't turn that on yet, but just to show you, this is the other speaker. Oh, that's right, that's not working yet. All right. So we're gonna turn this screen on. And I left it on PC the other day, so it should come up without having to change the input. We're gonna hit this amp. It's on, hit booth, that's set. Speaker A is for this only. If you want it out in the patio over here, then you can have both of these on on this one. So you have A and B. When you do this one, it splits it half and half. So you can hear it go down quieter. It went quieter, but now it's in both speakers. So just turn it up. Okay. So now you hear it over here. The screen's going. And we should have it out in the patio now. Just that one. We need to fix that one. But there we go, we got it out on the patio. So this is all set.